This is the book of Joel, chapter 3, verse 9. Proclaim ye this amongst the Gentiles. Prepare war. Wake up the mighty man. Let all the men of war draw near and let them come up. Joel, chapter 3, verse 10. Beat your plowshares and swords and the plummy hooks into spears and let the weak say I am strong. Shalom. First and foremost, I'd like to give all praises and glory and honor to you to Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai Bashem, Akarkadash. Shalom to the uh, elders, what I can, what I go off, and I say shalom. And this is a uh, sit down lesson that I want to bring out from the Jerusalem Post, published December the 18th, 2023, by Reuters and Breeds. Yemen's Houthis prepared to confront any U.S. foreign coalition that deploys to the Red Sea. Mohammed Al Bokrakti, a member of the Houthi. Politia Bureau, if I pronounced that right, to Alger Al Jazeera on Monday that his group will be able to confront any confrontation formed by the United States could deploy to the Red Sea. Early on Monday, the U.S. Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin gave a joint press conference with his Israeli counterpart saying, We are taking action to build an international coalition. This is not just a U.S. problem, it's an international problem. Austin announced that a virtual meeting could be held on Tuesday between him and fellow minister to address this threat. Houthi official Al Bertakti, if I pronounce his name right, also told the Al Jazeera that the U.S. offers not to obstruct efforts towards a lasting peace in Yemen in exchange for Houthis halting their military operations in the Red Sea. We are categorically reject this, he said. We're at 1 Thessalonians 5 and verse 3, prime example. And this is uh, Joel 3 and verse 9. Proclaim ye this amongst the Gentiles. Prepare war. Wake up the mighty man. Let all the men of war draw near. Let them come up. Verse 10. Book of Joel chapter 3 verse 10. I'm reading again for edification's sake. <coughs> Meet your plowshares and the soils and the plenty hooks and the spears and let the weak say I'm strong. So with that, hopefully this uh, sit down lesson was uh, edifying of this recent news article from the Jerusalem Post as of December 18, 2023 by Reuters as tensions are starting to increase once again over there in the Red Sea between the uh, Iranian-backed Houthi rebels versus the United States soldiers in its armory versus uh israelis israeli defense force as well too as it says again yemen's houthis prepared to confront any u.s foreign coalition that deployed deploys to the red sea and so with that i'd like to give all praises and glory and honor too to yahweh bashem yahweh shai bashem akar kadash shalom to the uh, elders and until next time, I will say, Shalom.